Today, Heidi Collins, I'm back filming literally. I'm so excited to film this video. It is probably my most requested video on my whole channel. I have literally got non stop messages for you guys asking me to do this video. So I'm really excited because today I am filming it. Today, Heidi Collins, I'm going to be doing a back to school shopping haul. So I'm going to be showing you guys everything that I got for when I go back to school in literally a couple of days, which isn't fun. Or fresh but I am gonna be showing you all my stationery a little bits like a few like bits like my bag and everything that I got to help me be more successful in this new school year so I hope you guys enjoy this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up and go subscribe right down below to become a hashtag Heidi Corn. it will mean so 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 much if you can go and click the subscribe button right down below and get me to my goal which is 500 subscribers so yeah basically going for the subscribe button right down below and yeah we're gonna get straight in to the video and let's see what I got for my back to school shopping okay Heidi Corns we are right into the video I am so excited I have so much stuff here I was gonna start this haul off with showing you like some of my uniform bits that I got like my whole uniform and like my shoes and that but really I have so much stationery right now that I'm not gonna have time to so we're gonna jump straight in to the stationery which isn't a bad thing, I absolutely love it so much. Okay, so we're gonna start with my school bag. I got a new school bag this year, so I've had the same school bag for two years. I think I've had the same one for two years. It was a Ted Baker school bag. I still have it. It is absolutely gorgeous. It was quite expensive. I bought it for my birthday and with some birthday money, and it was a hundred pounds, I believe. I will still use that bag as a everyday bag that I will bring out with me if I'm going out. Seriously, it's so beautiful. I love it so much. Um, and I did use it for school. Um, but I just thought I'd switch it up this year. I wanted to go some for something a little bit not new. I wanted stuff with more compartments in because I just love it when bags have little slots so you can have like designated things for things to go in. Um, and that bag had like a little wallet and that was basically it. It was just like a throw-in bag where everything was like clumped in together so i went to dorothy perkins and i initially was going to get a backpack like just in jd but they had no backpacks for me literally nothing like, i'm telling you now it was all just boys backpacks and i was thinking sis are you going to cater for me they didn't i'm disappointed not gonna lie but i decided to go for a handbag again i absolutely love it i feel like this bag is so so smart so it looks like this i need to move over so you guys can see it so it looked like it looks like this. It is a bag from Dorothy Perkins. It is a brown bag. I absolutely love it. I love how it's like kind of gold on it. It has like a really cute little tassel on it. I absolutely love it. It's so beautiful. So it has a bit here where you can open, put stuff in there, which I think is amazing. And then inside it has such handy bits in it, which I'm generally so happy about. So it's a zip up bag, which also I like because I can't just throw stuff in it as well. And also, um, my stuff, like my bag will be sitting there in mass. And if it's not a zip up bag, it all tumbles out, like all my pencil case will go everywhere. So I'm really happy that it's a zip up bag as well. Inside it has a zip up compartment and then two compartments, which will fit my phone in perfectly, which is so good. And it will fit in like some snacks and then it just has a lot of space in it. I am so happy with this. This was £25 from Dorothy Perkins and I love it. I feel like with my school uniform, it's going to be such a smart bag. Like, it's going to look very, like, smart with my uniform. Um, so, yeah, I absolutely love it. It's so pretty and so cute. Look at that. I absolutely love that. I'm not even going to lie to you. It's gorgeous. So, yeah, I got this from Dorothy Perkins for my school bag for year 10. Um, so now I'm going to start off with all of my stationery. So I'm going to obviously try and tell you the prices of it if it still has the tags on, if I can remember. But if it doesn't, I apologise and I will try and find out, maybe put some in the description for you guys. But I am going to get straight into it and I'm going to show you all my stationery, which is my favourite part. Okay, so I also want to know I have quite a lot of... Like, I tried to be more practical this year and not be very, like, just get, like, colourful pens and, like, all this, like, stuff. I still have, like, colourful pens, but I mean, like, being more practical with it and knowing, like, getting the stuff I need, basically, and not... <laughs> Basically not going and buying like loads of stuff that I don't need, which happens every single year. Um, 
So I actually went and got some stuff that's gonna help me benefit me because this year is seriously gonna be my year. I'm not even joking, I've always said it since year seven. I this year 10 is gonna be my year and I'm gonna work so hard this year and try and get my grades and I'm just gonna try and work hard because I need to get those GCSEs that I do. So yeah, I'm gonna go straight in and I'm gonna show you now my stationery that I got. So I'm starting with the pencil case. I got this pencil case. It is absolutely adorable. I'm not even gonna lie to you, I love it. It's so cute. It's a holographic pencil case. It's slightly see-through. I like see-through pencil cases. I absolutely love these because you can kind of see where stuff is. The only thing with these is when people like ask to like borrow a pen and then break it. No, I'm joking, last year. If you're like one of those people that always broke my pens and asked asked to borrow it and didn't take care of my pen and started chewing it and biting it and throwing it around the classroom you're not borrowing a pen this year I swear I'm literally gonna have a list of people that can okay I'm not that petty don't worry this one anyway so this is so cute it's a holographic one it has small dots all over it and this was from WH Smith and it was not gonna lie to you I do think it's quite expensive for a pencil case it was eight pounds um but I do really like it I love the size I love the shape I love everything basically about this it's so pretty so I got this to keep all my pens in this year and I absolutely love it it's so cute so I got this from WH Smith and I got it as my pencil case so I think I'm going to start off with the things I got from WH Smith obviously because I started with the pencil case so it's like branded if you get what I mean so the next thing I got from WH Smith was some singular pens so I got two um, I feel like WH Smith is always quite overpriced not going to lie I mainly went there to get my pencil case because they do really beautiful pencil cases but I feel like getting pens and general stationery from there is so expensive like if I got all of everything that I got here in WH Smith I'm telling you it would have been like a hundred pounds so I'm so glad that I didn't spend didn't go WH Smith so I got two singular pens so my nice pens the ones that I will be writing with a lot so I got this one first which is the Papermate Ink Joy pen which is like the gel one and this is so nice I absolutely love this this is like two pounds and I had this last year, it makes my handwriting look so nice and it's just a really nice pen, so I got this pen. Then I actually need different colours for marking in my school, so I got this pen which has everything in it and it's silver and it is the Bic one, the one with the like loads of clicky stuff on it. It has blue, green, black and red with it so I can use this to mark and I also can use it as a normal pen which I think is great. Um, and yeah, I just got this, this was like £2.50 I think, which isn't actually that bad but when I went into Will Code today they were all a pound and I'm thinking... I got ripped off but yeah this is really cute and I got this for uh, just like a singular pen that I bought so the last thing that I got from WH Smith was some highlighters so I got these Stabilo Boss ones I don't know I think that's I'm gonna say it like that please don't come in the comments and attack me for that I don't know how to say it but I'm just gonna say it like that so please don't be triggered by that I got this pack of eight and I noticed so basically they have double colours so they have like two yellows, two pinks, two blues and then two odd colours. So I decided, so me and my brother are going to separate them so my brother's going to have the yellow, pink, blue and orange and I'm going to have the blue, purple, pink and yellow. So I never actually ever use the orange or the green anyway so it's going to be fine, I'm literally just going to have these ones and they are so cute and these are my favourite colours out of all of them so me and we're going to half these, these were £7.99 if you purchase something so obviously I got the pencil case, my brother got some bits and I got some pens and that um, from there so we got these for £7.99 which is really good and yeah I love these, these are so cute, I definitely am up for this blue as well like they look so pretty so yeah, I got these really cute highlighters. So that's everything that I got from WH Smith, which is over there. And now I'm gonna start with what I got from Typo. I got this stuff quite a while ago. I got two things. I went shopping at the shopping centre with my friend Leah, and we both went and got some bits to a back to school. And I got some notebooks, and so did she. So we have matching notebooks, but I'm gonna show you them. They're so cute. So I got these two notebooks. I do feel like they're quite big. I do have some mini ones down there, so it's all fine don't worry um, but these are so pretty so I got this first one and it just says dreaming of some vitamin C and it's so pretty it's in like some gold writing and it's just got the C on it and I also love that it has this little strap around it as well because it just keeps all the paper in so it's not going to get like scrumped up scrumped up and then it just has a little pocket for any homework or notes in and this was how much? this was three pounds fifty and i just love this it's so pretty and it's so cute and yeah this is the first notebook that i got from typo so yeah i got that from typo 
I then got this one and it says to-do list and it just says like, you know, overthink, overthink, overthinking <laughs> me. Um, it's just got this really pre pretty like marble coral color kind of print over it. It's coral at the back, my favorite color ever. And yeah, it's just got gold on it. It's got the same little strap on it and it was £3.50 and I just think these are really good. It's always so handy to have some notebooks because obviously you can choose to have dedicated subjects to notebooks or you can just have like, it's just good to take notes. So I got these to bring to school just so I can take notes in lessons and bring it home to do my revision. So got these super cute notebooks, they're actually so nice. And now I'm gonna start with what I got from Wilco. So I actually went today and got my last bits. I was stressing so bad because I literally like got everything last minute. I got most of like my bag. I got my bag yesterday and I go to school in a few days. So I just quickly went, got everything from Wilco so I can film it now because I feel like I don't wanna leave it too late to film this video. So I'm going straight in. I'm not gonna show you what I got from Wilco. So, I went to Wilco, everything was half price. I was like, okay, thank you, that is great. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna show you what I got. So first things first, I got these cute highlighters. These are from Stavolo Boss. Please, yeah, again, don't attack me with that. Um, but these are some neon highlighters and these are the ones that look a bit like paints. I don't know if you can see, they're like really cute. Um, and I feel like it's good to always have pastel to make your books look nice, but also if you need to like proper catch information out of something, it's good to have some neon ones. So I got these neon ones and they're just gonna be really good if I just need to highlight information out of like text and that and like English, I just thought it'd be quite good. So I got these neon ones. They come in a pack of four and you get a yellow, orange, green and pink. And they're really cute and I like the way they're in like little tubes as well which is so nice so they look like this they're so nice so I got these I don't actually know how much they were I think they were like two pounds which is really good like normally they're like I swear they're like five pounds normally so yeah I got these so 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 super cute highlighters from Wilco's then I actually got this Tipex pen I am always making like mistakes in my book and I'm always I hate crossing it out so I feel like Tip Hex just saves my life there. It's just really good because I can obviously just go over it and make it look all nice and it just saves me time and just saves me stress. So I got this Tip Hex pen. I think this was like two pounds as well, which is really good. It's all half price. I was like, thank you. So it looks like this, just a normal Tip Hex pen and it's the correction one. Nothing really to say about it, but it just looks like this. And I love that, it's super cute actually. And I knit this, it's well needed. So then I got some pens. So I got my favourite pens ever. These are the ones I used last year. Unfortunately they run out, but they're literally my favourite pens ever for my handwriting. They're the Zebra Ballpoint st Stylo pens. And these are just so good. I swear everyone raves about these as well, but I do generally, these are my favourite pens ever. My two favourite pens that I'd like to use for nice handwriting are the Papermate gel ones and the Zebra ones. So I got a pack of 10 and me and my brother are going to half these again because I'm not going to need 10 pens and neither is he. So we're just going to half these again. That is the pro of having a sibling because you can just half things and it's just so much easier. Um, so we got these zebra ones. They've got like the little grips on them and then the Z grip ones. I generally love these. They're so good for handwriting. If you want pens that are really smooth and really good to write with and have really smooth like ink, um, definitely check these out. These are so good. I love these. So... Yeah, I got these. I think these were like four or five pounds, um, which is pretty pricey because like some of them are much more cheaper. Um, but these are really worth it. So got these pens. I love these a lot. Then I got some pencils. These were actually a pack of four. My brother half them yet again because it's just easier. We're not going to need like four pencils each, are we? So we just half them yet again. I don't really need, my brother has more pencils than me because I don't actually really need it like that much. I only need it for like math, science, drawing kind of things. But obviously he has art still. Get eight now, so he still does art. I'm in year 10 now, so obviously I don't do art because I didn't choose it. Um, But yeah, I just got these two pencils. These are by the brand Bic and they just have the really cute little what are called the little yellow plasticky rubber things on the top and then there's some really good pencils and they look really good so these are the evolution ones and these were like three pounds for a pack of four which is really really good and i just really think they're gonna look cool so i got some little blue pencils so the next thing i got from wilco's was a ruler i have been looking everywhere for a ruler that does the snappy thing so it snaps in half to become a 30 centimeters and goes down to be a 15. it goes like this into a 30 centimeter and then you go snap it 
and it goes into like a one that goes can fit in your pencil case like this it's gonna fit in there so smart genuinely whoever came up with that you a lifesaver so yeah i got this ruler i think this was one pound which is really good and yeah i keep saying really good a lot i'm sorry but yeah i got this ruler the next thing i got from wilco's was i got these little things which are going to be so handy for me so i took triple science because when i'm older i do want to be a vet um like so far that's what i'm thinking of my career being so I got these little Wilco sticky tabs. These are just really good because when I have like, I have revision guides and when I'm doing a test or I just need to flick for a page and find something quickly, I can write down like the heading of the page, stick it kind of out the book. So my book has the headings out of it instead of me having to go and find the page number. So I got these and it's also good because if I'm like, um, say like I'm rereading like a Christmas Carol, I need to like mark my page. These are just little page markers and they're the Wilco ones. And these were, I think these were like, a pound but yeah they're really good they're just on this little bit of a plastic thing i could just peel them off so i got these and they're gonna be like so handy so the next thing i got from Wilco's was a calculator now it's very chunky very bulky so i didn't want to get a casio calculator just because genuinely they're like 25 pounds everywhere i saw them they're 25 pounds i'm like i'm not like I'm not getting a calculator for £25, that's ridiculous. Like, I'm not even probably going to use it, like, that much. Even though I probably will. Because my teachers... I only will use this calculator, really, in maths. Because in science, I use the school ones. Because they're actually they're actually good. The ones in maths, they're so bad. They have, like, chewing gum stuck to the bottom of them. It is really, really not okay. So, I got this one. It's just, like, a little calculator. It's a little case in it. It's scientific. It was £4. That is just such a bargain. So it just looks like this, little scientific calculator. It works so fine. So yeah, I don't really see the difference in calculators. So I just thought, you know what? I'm not very good at maths anyway. I just want to pass maths. So <laughs> so I just need a calculator to help me pass it. But yeah, I'm literally, tell me if you can relate down below. My worst lesson is maths. I can't get it. I just, someone could sit there and explain it to me for like eight hours. And I still wouldn't get anything. But yeah, I got a calculator because that is obviously what I need. And it is from Wilco's. Basically just... Okay, so the next thing I got from Wilco was some bits for revision. So this year, obviously I'm saying I literally, I just want to get like my best grades right now. Literally, that's all I'm caring about right now. I don't care what people think of me. I don't care about what's going on in school. I just care about getting my grades right now. So I'm definitely stocking up for stuff for revision because I'm going to work so, so hard this year and try and achieve everything that I possibly can. So I got these 100 record cards. These are 75p. That is just so good. And these cards basically i can peel it off and i can write my revision notes on it i'm one of those people that have kind of i'm quite good with like photo not photographic but i can i like to kind of visualize it like read it so i can write down loads of bits of information on these and i can flick like go take them off stick it these are just gonna be really good so i can just test myself write notes down make little revision cards i just think that's gonna be really good so i got these little record cards to be really good for revision and then I also found, my mum found this when we were down the aisle, and these are actually so good, not even going to lie to you. So when I have a, like, exam or test, like whatever you call it, especially when I have my mocks coming up, I found this. This was a pound, and it's got a little thing on it. It just says, today is the day, and it's a little revision pack. And you open it, and it's a flip book, and it's really good. I like how it's all, like, got this little thing on it, because I like to take a little pack with me, even if I make my little booklet, and I like to take it into school. I like to sit down before I go into the, like, before I go to do the test, and I kind of like to even just inform time, just sit down, flick through some revision notes, and just have this with me, really. And this is going to be so good, because it has all of the bits of paper for revision. And I could just write my revision notes in here and just flick for it, have a little flip book. So I think I'm going to use this for science, um, science maybe English as well, um, so I can write my quotes down. So it's probably a science and English one that I can have a little flip book. But yeah, I love this, it's so handy. So I got this one, we'll close my revision. Last thing I actually got was this little rubber from Wilco and they had no rubbers there, literally none. They had this one 30 piece, so I just had to kind of get this one. Even though I have some of my pencils, it just says Wilco on it. <laughs> we do love a bit of Wilco. Um, it's just a little eraser thing, so I got this. Okay, so that's everything I got from the shop. So now I'm going to show you some stuff that I was actually really kindly given, which is so, so nice. So thank you so much. 
So my mum's work friend actually has a daughter that's moving to Australia and she had loads of stationery and she actually decided to give it to me which is so nice, so thank you. So she got me these, I was going to buy these anyway so I can't actually believe I have them like already. These are the Stubble Boss um, fine liners and they come in all different colours, they are like so nice. Oh right, this colour is just getting me right now. It's like a really pretty blue. Um, but yeah, I've got these fine liners. These are actually so nice. I'm so excited to use these in English. It's going to be so handy. So thank you so much. So she gave me them. And she also gave me these metallic pens, which are so cool. These are by a brand. It's like Faber, Faber Castle metallic pens. And they all clip together like this. This is so cool. They all go together. So I have a purple a blue a green and a pink and a gold and the gold's like a sparkly one these are gonna be really cool to like do my revision with so i'm gonna keep these at home with me to do like some cool revision with because i probably wouldn't be able to be a or even be allowed to use in my school books but these are definitely going on my little desk bit here and i'm definitely using them for revision so thank you so much and yeah that is all of my stationery that i got for back to school so guys i hope you guys enjoyed that video make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe right down below it'll mean the absolute world if you can hit the subscribe button um, and get me close to 500 subscribers which you're 50 away from right now which is breathtaking I am so excited um, and I can't believe we're growing the Heidi Corn community a lot which is very exciting I am really happy with everything I got I'm very grateful to be able to have this stationery and have everything here so I'm not bragging at all I just want to show you guys because you guys wanted this video as I said it was actually the highest requested video I have ever had on my channel I got constant DMs of asking me when it's going to be up so yeah I love you all so so much make sure to go and click the subscribe button and yeah I'll see you in the next video bye Mwah. <laughs>